A typical day for me, I wake up, brush my teeth, make a cup of coffee because that is essential to getting through anything else that follows. I do a 6.30 meeting every morning um, with some of the information technology managers um, to talk about um, any hot issues of our day, any areas where we may need support. Um, and they are based on the East Coast, and it just worked better for me to get it done before my day really starts. Um, so 6.30 for me, that's 9.30 for them. Uh, we have our 15-minute sync. Uh, usually while I'm talking to them, I am prepping my son's lunch for school and, you know, doing whatever I can to keep my morning moving. Um, after we hang up, I finish getting ready. Usually somewhere in there, my son will wake up. He's five. Then I try to be out the door by 740-ish, and we will head in together. We've got about a just under 30-minute drive to get to his school. I'll drop him off, and I will come into work and start my day. Our office space is pretty open. Um, we only executives have offices and the rest of us sit in an open concept. Um, it's a beautiful space with a huge kitchen. So I'll usually, uh, as I'm catching my breath, make some breakfast for myself and then um, make my way to my desk, which is all the way in the back of the office. So Typically, from leaving the kitchen and getting to my desk tends to be a lot of chit-chat with people, um, sometimes work-related hot items on the day, um, you know, if someone needs an answer or if I need an answer and I see them, um, you know, I'll snag them and try to have that conversation. So at 9 a.m., my meetings um, will start, and it's usually an opportunity for me to uh, connect with uh, different team members on projects um, to understand where we are with upcoming deadlines, uh, to have a sense of how they're feeling in meeting those deadlines, um, and to be aware of any concerns um, or issues that I could help, um, you know, remove any blocks uh, or, you know, be proactive in resolving any issues before they truly become issues and delay our projects. Um, I also spend a lot of time talking with uh, vendors. Um, so if we are implementing a new tool, uh, whoever I'm working with from the company of that tool, um, I will have calls with them to also talk about where we are with our deliverables and any potential delays that I see um, and how that may impact the overall timelines of the project. Um, so that is pretty much my day. I will meet with different teams, uh, different vendors, different groups of people for projects, talk through these items. And when I'm not in meetings, I will be actioning on anything that came up. Um, as easy as documenting meeting notes so that we have a record of what was discussed. Um, and then, um, you know, more complicated potentially following up and trying to resolve some of those issues. I make a lot of lists. That is my favorite thing to do. I love post-its and making little notes and reminders, and then I love crossing them off <laughs> as I make my way through the day. Um, and I always have a goal of crossing off every list item in a day, and it has never happened. And I've come to accept that that is why tomorrow is another day. So... Um, Usually around five o'clock, I need to get everything together to get out the door um, so that I could pick up my son in time for before his day ends. Um, and then either we head to karate or swim lessons or one night a week, we just go home and chill. <laughs> um, and then depending on how I'm feeling with things, sometimes... 
uh, after dinner and activities and bath time and book time. Uh, when my son goes to sleep, sometimes I may log back on and answer some emails that I didn't have a chance to get to or even as I'm doing all these activities, um, sometimes a good idea will come to mind that I'll want to document or um, you know, something that I was really struggling with, a solution may just come to me as I'm doing all these other things and not focusing on it. Um, so once that idea comes, I don't want to lose it. And so I'll log back onto my computer and try and make some notes and follow-ups. At the end of the day, I find I need a few laughs, so I'm really into watching stand-up comedy. Um, so I have some favorites that I just like to unwind to and then go to sleep.